Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. It is time for a match day vlog. If you saw my preview earlier today, uh, it was a very sunny down in South London, nice weather here. It is absolutely pissing it down again. It seems like every vlog I do now, it seems to be raining and really, really dreary. I seem to bring the weather with me everywhere, wherever I go. Um, so got in really good time. Team news is out. Zahar is starting and I'm a bit worried about that because I don't think he's going to be fully fit. The fact he came back early from international break with um, an abductor injury or a strain, not an injury, but that's something that can keep you out for a few weeks a strain and I don't think he'll be fully fit today I think Roy's put him in forced him in because we need him in and our record without him in is so poor but I think if you just rested him for this game and made sure he was fully fit for our really tough run coming up then I think that would be more valuable to us than trying to force him to get in and try and scrape a point today because I'm not confident Gomez starts for Everton it's his debut and he's obviously a threatening player when he can obviously come from Barcelona big big move um, Bernard, they've got a lot of pace and that doesn't worry me as much as some fans would think because I think that wan Saka and Van Arnold can handle the pace out wide. The problem is if when they go forward and uh, Everton try and counter-attack us really quickly, I do worry about our wing-backs being forward and then bot getting us on the break because then Saka and Tompkins are definitely not the pacey, pacey uh, centre-back. So, fingers crossed we get something out of today. I'm not confident, like I said. I do think that Everton will um, probably snatch this, but if we can get a 1-1 draw or something like that, I think there'll be goals from both ends if we do get a draw. I don't think it'll be a goalless draw, but if we can get a point, I'll be very, very happy with that going into this tough run coming up. So, come on, Palace. Let's make this journey up here worth it. 11, Theo Walcott. 12, Lucas D. 17, Adrissa Garnagay. Teams are about to go off really important. We can have a good performance today, even if we don't win. Just a good performance to get the fans on beat. It's been a lot of, lot of miserable, upset fans at the moment for obvious reasons. You know, Maya's out with an illness, a virus, so hopefully we don't miss him too much. And so hopefully he's ours on it. But I just really hope we have a good performance. You never know, we can get a point out of this if we all played our best. Eagles, Eagles, come on, boys! Games kicked off, decent stuff from Palace, end to end. It's only a few minutes in. I've had to move because there's some people behind me who wanted to sit down. I didn't want to didn't annoy them, so I moved back where there's a bunch of seats available back here. So Everton on the attack here, crossing well away from Tompkins. Lively start to the game, still nil nil. Too good for you! He's just too good for you! Will Swan, as you can tell, Will Swan, a really good free kick, dangerous position here. Got about 30, 35 yards out. Luke over it. I think he's going to try and clip this to the back post, try and get a header on it, maybe across the face of goal. Good chance here though, what was it, just over five minutes in. Come on, good ball from Luca. Back stick, go on Tonkins. Oh, get there, get there. Ah, Tonkins got there, just didn't get enough on the ball. Everton on the attack here, Richarlison. What a challenge from Tonkins. What a tackle. One on one with Tonkins and he's taken the ball for Charleston. Counter attack now. Luca gave the ball away again in the midfield and they countered from it. Really poor from Luca. Come on, boys. Go on, go on, McCarthy. That's space. Back stick, Will. Oh, volley at the back stick. He had time, but he's blazed it well out over the bar. Decent from Palace. But Luca's got a buck his ideas up again, giving the ball away way too easily. Wow, poor back pass from Zuma there. He did well to get the ball in their defence under pressure. Passed it back. Was short. Townsend, I think, almost got there first. They've just dealt with it, Everton. But nice little pick of the play from Palace. Fairly even right now. Happy with how it's going so far. Really happy. Fancy! Shlop, hit it! Where are you going, Shlop? Oh, Will's just been taken out down by Sigurdsson. That's a Sigurdsson third foul already. Good counter. It's getting lively now. Honestly. There's a goal coming here, there is a goal coming here if we can keep this up. Honestly, I'm feeling much better than I did at the start of the game. Hey, you know, you know it's by our noise. Brian and South London, the famous Palace boys. Oh, 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 oh Great reaction save, diving to his left. Corner, first real chance there for Everton as well. He did well to stay alert, need to watch our marking there. Need to watch our marking, come on, corner, deal with this Palace. 
First real chance for Everton. Wayne Hennessy! Deal with it. Well done, Keate, second. And we're out on the counter. Go on, Will. Look it! Well done, Red. Well done. He's got this one right. Bad well time. Not long to half time now, it's a free kick in a dangerous position for Everton, Sigerson over it, about 25 yards out, something like that. This is dangerous, I do not feel good about this. Hit the wall, get him now! One for Saka, one for Saka, one for Saka, one for Saka. So it's half time here at Goodison Park, Everton nil, Palace nil. Quite a shock for me actually. We're going back to the 4 4 2 that really didn't do very well against Wolves before the international break. Everton have got a very strong team. I was worried before kickoff. I thought to Hari, I don't know if he's really fit. No Meyer as well with illness. I wasn't too confident, but we've been the better team this half. In all fairness, we have. Uh, showed a lot of attacking intent. When we had the ball, we used it really well. Nice, quick tempo. You know, when we did get the ball away, we did very well defensively getting it back. Really quick to get it back. Wamba Saka and Tom Kims have done very well at the back. Saka has been good as well. Zaha, and like I said, going forward, we've hit the bar. Uh, a good save from uh, uh, Pickford off Milivojevic free kick. A couple of good chances. We, you know, if we would put one of them away, which we probably should have, we probably deserved one of them to go in. I, you know, I think it'd be a deserved to be one 0 half time. But I will take nil nil 100%. Got to carry it on second half because Everton, you know, they weren't quite on it. It's very likely they'll be a lot better and a lot more. A lot quicker in possession, a lot, a lot more uh, useful when they have the ball, you know, use the ball a lot better in the second half. So, got to carry us on to say now, but I'm very happy this away day so far. A lot of back, bit of back and forth here, I'm right next to the home fans, so you can, you can see they're literally right there. So, bit of back and forth during that game, but I love it. It's all, it's all banter, you know, no one means any of it. Um, so, yeah, same against second half, I'll be very happy if we can carry on, get the point, and uh, yeah, a goal would be nice. Come on, boys, big off. A few minutes in, but it's a much better start from Everton. We've hardly had a foot on the ball. They've already had, this is their second corner coming up in a few minutes. Um, much more lively. Got to get on the foot on the ball and try and just kill the tempo. All of the time! All of the time! Say that you need me! Say that you need me! Come on, Dylan. Cross comes in. Jeez. Keen leapt, but it was too high. Skimmed off his head for a goal kick. Penalty! Zaha! No! Get in there! No! No! Come on! Come on! Got to score this! We have to score this! We've deserved it! We have to score it now! Jesus wept. Oh, should have scored. Man playing on the right. His name is Andrews Townsend and he's fucking dynamite. I can't believe he missed that pen. It's been really lovely since, I mean, end to end. I mean, got to make sure we don't let that get to our hands. Keep doing what we're doing because we deserve it. But Everton almost scored just now. Deserve it, man. That's such a big, big miss. He's having a poor season as well. That would have. Well in, Luca. He's having a poor season. That would have, you know, corrected a lot of wrongs he's made this season. Getting nervy now. We had a break in play with a Tonkins injury. He's all right, but settled down a bit now. He's picked up Everton corner. It's getting nervy now. Last 10 minutes or so. Killer if they score now. Absolute killer. Cross. Yes, Keate. Out. They still got it. They still got it. Good block. It's nervy now. I'll take a draw, but... I think we, we still haven't made a sub there, it's still 10 minutes to go. Well, 10 minutes to go, Everton are going all for it. Taking off Walcott and uh, Gomez, who had a bit of an average debut, in my opinion. Calvert Lewin and Lookman. So, all three of their subs are all strikers. Really attacking three changes. So, 
he's going for it. He wants to win it, obviously, Silver, but and it's going to be dangerous on the break. That's really pa a lot of pace on the break. And Richarlison still on, so nervy now. Nervy last 10 minutes, but still haven't made a sub roy. Please, Wickham on just a bit of physicality and change it up. Dangerous position, Everton free kick again, just, just about four minutes plus injury time to go. Sigurdsson to over it, whips it. Oh, what a header from Sacco. Out! Tosin! Good block! Jesus, so scary, man. Oh, this would be a really, really good point if we can get it. Despite the penalty miss, it would be a really good point. Just don't do a ball move, please. Oh, well done, Sacco. What an interception. Get it out! So, so unfair. Come on now, get Ayu and Wickham on, get everyone on now. Killer, absolute killer. Long ball forward on the counter, 2 0 Tosin. So undeserved, two goals in two minutes. Undeserved. Everton fans, so poor from them. Giving it large to the fans now, couldn't hear them for 90 minutes. It's so poor. It really is poor support. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nothing against Everton, but really poor support. So unfair, man. Undeserved. And now we bring on Wickham. Roy, you're so frustrated. We bring Wickham on now. Full time here at Goodison. It's I think 7 and 2 Palace. And you're two goals in the last two minutes from uh, Calvert Lewin, sub, and Tosin. Two subs, two goals. Roy waited until we were 2-0 down to make a sub. That's, I think that was a big part of why we lost as well. We deserved something like that. We deserved at least a point. If that penalty had gone in, I think we would have gone on to win 2-0 ourselves, if I'm honest. It's a shame, but onwards and upwards, we've got a very tricky run now. It's a really, real shame we couldn't get anything out of that because we need something going into this run. But we've got to keep our heads up. The performance was good. It's just we keep conceding sloppy goals right at the end, like Bournemouth as well. Sloppy goals that have cost us points. So got to keep the chin up. See what happens in the awful run we've got coming up, but <clears throat> final score here 2 0 to Everton. Scutted. Like, share, subscribe, guys.